Well, thank you so much for being here. Today, I wanted to show you some bulbs that I worked on recently, and I'm going to do some more bulbs today. So I poured on these bell-shaped bulbs, and I used clearly blue and silver and white, and then the other ones are gold and red. And the way that I did it is I put the colors on one at a time because I really wanted them to blend together as they dripped off of the bulb. And I really love the results. I love how they've just merged within each other. So I have these new bulbs here that are about five inches round. They're pretty big. And I bought a bunch of them, so I'm just gonna do three today. So I have them on top of some funnels, but to be honest, the opening of these bulbs are quite large and the funnels are not holding them exactly straight but um, I'm able to compensate for that as I pour the paint. So I'm working on a 16 by 20 canvas. I'm going to let the drippings just hang out on the canvas and work on something when I'm done. So I've used titanium white. I have this light denim color and then I also have um, Diox purple. Some of these colors are just mixed with water and then some of them do have a medium in them but as you'll see as we go I am going to be using quite a few colors that are already pre-mixed in bottles that you just buy at the store and here what I'm doing is I'm just making sure that the bottom well it'll be the top eventually but the bottom of the bulb has um, paint on it so that it can all run off fluidly as I pour the paint so what I'm going to do is just do one color at a time and it may look like a lot of paint, but I'm doing it on purpose so that I have enough paint on my canvas to make a painting later. And I just want to find the right colors. I want to have the right blend. Um, it's not specifically going to be blue and purple. I'm going to do a lot of different colors and just get it right until I'm happy with it. So I hope that you are having a great day. Thank you so much for watching. This is Gretchen with Crazy Lady Creations. And I just wanted to do a happy Merry Christmas bulb pour. Give it a try. It's actually quite fun. You don't have to use expensive paints to pour on these. These are just plastic bulbs that you buy at the store. And you can use any paint you want, even if you want to use the inexpensive craft paint. You can always add water or Floetrol mediums to um, beef up the paint to make it a little more quality. But I'm just using, obviously I'm using the bottles that I bought at the store. Some are Arteza, some are Deco Art. Um, this one I love. This, this green is shimmery. And what happens is the green's gonna pop through some of the other colors and have a cool shimmer effect. So I like what um, the paints are doing. I love how they're flowing together. I like that they're going to constantly um, be on top of each other. So I hope that you guys will stick to the end and see how these turn out. Um, they're pretty decent. I'm pretty happy with them. And again, thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate that you're here. And if you can share me with your friends, um, like and subscribe. That would be awesome. And what I'm going to do soon is speed up the video just times two because I want you to be able to see the colors that I'm laying in here. I want you to see how they're um, blending with each other, but I also don't want this to be a 30 minute video on three bulbs. So um, you're welcome. <laughs> so I am just gonna speed this up and I'm not really choosing colors based on a theme. I'm just kind of choosing what I had on hand in these pre-made bottles, but I do like how they're turning out. This one in particular is super cool when it dries. All right, you guys, I hope that you can comment and let me know your thoughts. Um, I do appreciate your comments and your likes, and I will talk to you soon. I won't actually, I won't talk to you, but I will look at your comments. <laughs> because I don't actually talk to you. I do talk to you. I'm talking right now and now I'm babbling. Anyway, I hope that you enjoy.
Thank you guys so much for watching and I really love how these turned out. This one in particular is so cute but I did change it a little bit. You'll see when I reveal it on the table. But I just love doing this. They're so much fun and if you have a chance do it with your friends and your family because you can do it too. It's not that hard. You guys have a great day and I hope that you have subscribed so you can see my next video. God bless and Merry Christmas.